Can medication affect your metabolism, aka weight loss journey? This here is a calorie chart, changing from 4,000 to zero. We all know that we burn a total calorie amount each day, and it's different for each person. Let's say for Danielle here, that it's 3,000 calories. Our total calorie burn is made up of four different elements, but we're just going to split it up into two for this video. Let's say 60% of your calorie burn is down to your metabolism, and let's say the other 40% is like exercise and sh Different medications can affect different areas. One for asks which medication affects what. I've done but there might be medications out there that down-regulate your metabolism by, say, I don't know, 5-10%. Or there's medication out there that actually causes fatigue and it might reduce the amount of exercise that you do. So let's say because of the medication that you're taking, you're now actually burning 500 calories less a day. Now then, is that going to stop you from losing fat? Well, let's say that you're eating 2,500 calories before without the medication, you actually might have been burning 3,000, so that would have created a calorie deficit. Now, because the medication's fucked, you're up, you're not burning as much because you're eating 2,500, you're also burning 2,500, meaning that you're not in a calorie deficit. So all you would do to counter this is just drop your calories down to say 2,000 to again create the calorie deficit. Now that's not all because there's another side effect to this. Medication can also make you extremely hungry. So you might find that sticking to 2,500 is extremely difficult and you might be eating everything in sight, meaning that all this here is weight gain. Medication will either do one of three things. One, downregulate your metabolism. Two, cause fatigue and cause you to burn less calories. Or three, make you really hungry. The shit part is sometimes medication can do all three. So what's the solution? Well, what we do in Team RH, we set people a step goal. Now, while it's still hard for them, if they hit that step goal, then they guarantee to burn the calories that they should be, whether on medication or not. And also because we're telling them to eat high protein and high fiber foods, that's helping with the cravings. So they're not wanting to eat everything in sight. If they stick to the calorie goal we set them, they lose fat every time. That still leaves us with the down-regulated metabolism. Thankfully, we can just drop your calories a little bit more. And also, study shows that a down-regulated metabolism isn't that much. Basically meaning, if it's the metabolism that's affected, it's not going to make or break whether you're going to lose fat or not. If you want everything working out for you, join teamrh.uk. Once you've joined, you can download our app, we'll set you the goals and then you'll start smashing it.